And we're done here, folks. Drop the mic. In the competitive, ever-changing world of speedrunning, you never really know who just might come along and start tearing their way through the leaderboards. It becomes even more of a guessing game when determining who will stick around, who will leave early, or who will burn out entirely. After the Thug 1 feud of Piatters and Silent Laws, a new contender that would shake up the game would arise, a humble speedrunner from North Carolina, the Packle. Thug1 served as Packle's first and most continually played Tony Hawk game. He started off slow garnering a few PBs in beginner any percent and began to build momentum at a rapid pace throughout late December 2014. With an eventual time of 42.17, Packle set comfy at second place behind Silent Laws. We'd also attain a 51.17 in normal any percent entering the new year, and then... nothing. Packle would take a break but return come May. Through the adaptiveness in Packle and teachings of butt slaps from Yib, Packle quickly caught up to speed. In fact, Packle became so adept at getting multiple butt slaps that fellow runners would jest about Packle using a turbo controller. The Tony Hawk prodigy would seek revenge on those who had overtaken him in his absence by rising above Piatters and Yib, and on May 13th, 2015, Packle hammered out a 3922, the first of many world records to come. The Packle would go on a tear, grinding out run after run, not giving up any ground. When a challenger would get close, Packle would distance the gap at any cost. His insane grinding sessions would remain virtually unrivaled. Through the months of May and June, Packle divided his attention between five categories. Thug 1 Beginner Any% percent, which he brought down from a 39 to a 37.15, Normal Any% percent, beginning with a 49.48 and cutting that down to gain another world record of 44.30, Beginner No Warp dropped from a 42.35 to a 40.51 run, making this Packle's third Thug 1 record, Normal No Warp going from a 48.10 to a solid 46.34, along with Thug 2 Classic Any% percent, where he claimed a respectable 552. Trends continued in similar nature during the next few months, improving upon his prior adventures along with picking up new speed games as well. By the end of August, Packle had lowered all his existing times in beginner any percent, beginner no warp, normal any percent, and normal no warp, along with achieving new world records and the second recorded Thug 1 sweep of all time, the 49.31 and sick any percent, and a 1 hour and 2 minute normal all story goals run. The newly crowned Thug King also sought Thaw supremacy and after a month of hard work and grinding would become a reality after a 55.21 run under the new timing, overthrowing Piatters. Packle also learnt Thug 2 Easy any percent and THPS 4 any percent, earning a 9.43 and 46.58 respectively. Moving forward, Packle continued his efforts on running THPS 4, 39.40, Thug 2 Classic, 3.50, and Thug 1 Normal any percent. 4142, but would prove his versatility once again by clocking times on the first two Tony Hawk games along with engaging Fog in a back and forth war in Project 8 any percent. Three vastly different games each holding their own unique engine, Packle juggled the task of learning these games well. He would make major improvements to his times in the initial two Pro Skater games, cutting his runtime in THPS 2 in half, resulting in an eventual 357, the second sub 4 in THPS 2 history. More drastic improvements came during his tenure of THPS 1 any percent speedrunning, starting off with a low 13 minute time all the way down to a 552. Packle would help Fog in routing Project 8 any percent, coming up with a major time save of Project 8 early that would skip over some of the troubling pro goals and holding the world record spot four separate times, most recently on September 18th, 2015. Because of the hard work the two Project 8 runners put into their game, they were able to turn their one plus hour attempts into mid 40 minute runs on a game not previously speedrun before. Packle eventually ended off with a 49.09. Satisfied with his progress in the two classic Tony Hawk games and his Project 8 efforts, it was time to return to the Thug games. Starting 2016 off right, Packle improved on some of his Thug 1 times again, Normal No Warp 4331, Normal Any% 4058, and Beginner No Warp 3851. Not shying away from Thug 2 either, he would tackle the classic categories. Classic All Goals would occupy Packle's time throughout mid-January 2016, eventually establishing a time of 2545. Next on the chopping block would be Classic Any% 337, 330, and a 324. Packle was within reach of the world record. What pushed him to keep going? One of the developers for the indie platforming game, A Hat in Time, offered Packle a free copy of the game if he successfully nailed a world record in a Tony Hawk game. Tempted by the offer, Packle hopped back on the grind, racking up a 317 on February 5th, 2016.
fucking over! Yes! Woo! After all the heavy work, Packle took to tassing Thug One Sick Any Percent for the first time. What came next was a string of amazing runs by the North Carolina native. 847 and Thug 2 Easy Any Percent, 536 and THPS 3 Any Percent, regaining world records and Thug One Story All Goals with a 5938, and Sick Any Percent with a 4742, yet another beginner Any Percent amendment of 3542. But what Packle wanted was to beat the guy everyone had their sights set on, a Tony Hawk savant and multi game world record holder, George. After many mad attempts, Packle would attain the first sub 4 minute Thaw Classic Any% percent time and his first world record over George on March 26, 2016. Through some routing and strat changes, Packle would repeat history by finally getting the world record for THPS2 Any% percent with a 322 on April 2, 2016. WORLD FUCKING RECORD! YES! FUCKING YES! After such an exhausting grind, Packle would take it easy for a bit, producing a beginner any percent tutorial in anticipation for a Thug speedrunning tournament, in an effort to try and raise awareness for Thug and attempting to recruit new speedrunners to the Tony Hawk scene. Along with this, the Packle would focus on console world records for Thug 1, garnering a 4201 on beginner any percent and a 4959 in normal no warp. To piggyback off the console running trend, Packle would also clutch an 841 for THPS 1 100% and a 1338 in any percent all careers for teach PS2X, a North American original Xbox release featuring levels from the first two games, and some bonus levels as well. WHAT THE FUCK?! Are you fucking serious?! Yeah, you can definitely tell these levels are designed very differently from traditional Tony Hawk levels, and they just really don't have that sort of flow and consistency. Uh... 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 I, guys? Uh... <laughs> What is going on? Wait. There's no way. <laughs> Wait. Wait, what? what Hello? Is going on? <laughs> what um, are you yeah. doing? <laughs> I, 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 are you, I, what are you soft on? I'm you soft mud your Xbox? Are you cheating? <laughs> where am I? One would think Packle's rampage was coming to a close with two consecutive George Bobs. Well, you would be wrong. On May 14th, 2016, Pack would secure a clean run, granted the routes and strats available at the time, solid movement, and with the limited knowledge on the functionality of video skip at the time, it was difficult to obtain, let alone consistently. Keep in mind this was before Big Law found an easier setup, so runners at the time would simply mash or pause buffer and pray for the skip. But Packle would execute everything well, resulting in a 35-16 and beginner any percent. On what seemed like the perfect note to go out on, Packle's real life priorities took over and speedrunning would have to take the back seat. Oh my god! Holy fucking shit! Yes! Holy fucking shit! Yes! While select runners like TH126, TK Mala, and Silent Laws had wrestled for control over every other category, Packle had remained the sole occupant of Beginner Any% percent ever since his 3922 run, from May 13th, 2015 to August 2nd, 2016. This is by no means an easy feat either. With a combination of fresh faces and old school vets, this 60 plus runner category is the most speedrun Tony Hawk category at the time of this recording. But who would be the one to end this reign? With new groundbreaking innovations and a few other tricks up his sleeve, a Teenage Thug 2 Story All Goals runner who picked up the game within that year would rise to the occasion and finally dethrone the Packle. Pokemon Ace 101. How would Packle adjust to the game-changing create-a-trick-abuse strategy known as Catbag, among other strats devised along the way? 
Late December would bring Packle's return to speedrunning. With some practice and a few days of attempts, a 34-35 presented itself, setting Packle back in first place. Ace wouldn't let this go without a fight, as he posted a 34-16 just one day later. With Ace Packle and Silent all with 34s, it was a race to the first sub-34. However, with the community run marathon right around the corner, the race would have to wait. In preparation for the second Tony Hawk's Pro Skater Marathon, Packle would begin de-rusting THPS3 any percent. This would result in a 502 during February 2017. After getting this new personal best and performing at the marathon, Packle would return to the Thug 1 foray. With the introduction of a brand new Thug 1 individual level leaderboard, it was an opportune time for Packle to refine his gameplay even more and sweep the beginner any percent IL leaderboards in the process during the end of May. Seizing the opportunity, Packle once again put on a show, leaving us with another run to remember. 3351 on June 11th, 2017. The first sub 34 beginner any percent run belonged to Packle. Yes! Let's fucking go! Let's fucking go! Yes! Shortly thereafter, normal any percent 3901, normal no warp any percent 4155, and normal all story goals 5817 would all fall back under Packle's control as well with three PBs on the same day of July 1st, 2017. Packle's name was atop the thug leaderboards again, and it was time for something different. Returning to teach PS2X once more, but this time to conquer the all goals, golds, and careers category. Packle completed a solid run of 3523 in the previously mentioned category, and in a little less than a week of learning, Packle would require a personal best in teach PS2 all goals, all golds of 1857. In anticipation for awesome games done quick 2017, Packle submitted for Teach PS2X, but with other real-life priorities hanging in the balance, his attendance at the marathon was uncertain. Regardless of this, Packle returned to the 2X grind for more practice, securing a 2959 on October 22, 2017. It was eventually confirmed that Packle would have to pull out of his AGDQ 2017 spot and put the third Tony Hawk marathon on hold. This is where we're left off. With these recent events and a fresh-faced English Thug 1 runner named Rushy swooping up several categories, it's a question mark as to what will happen next. I guess we'll have to wait and see. Anything can happen after all. The Packle is without a doubt one of the best Tony Hawk speedrunners to ever do it. His competitive spirit and aspirations to prove himself as one of the all-time greats drove him to incredible heights. He's been highly adaptable, constantly evolving his game, and has stood up to every challenger proving himself to be a proven champion of his games. With his vicious pop-offs and energetic rants, he's a truly passionate player and entertaining runner to watch. Packle is also prone to labbing his games, innovating strats like Quick Muska and Thug 1, and Project 8 early, along with figuring out how some existing strats worked. Eric Skip, Bell Skip, and Daytime Moscow. He also possesses the ability to nail what were considered difficult tricks at the time consistently, such as Video Skip and Daytime Moscow. And being a major figurehead of the Tony Hawk speedrunning community, organizing and scheduling community marathons with the help of Horse of the Sea, and additional help from Movement in China during the first marathon, setting up a community-run speedrunning tournament, producing trailers promoting said events, making a helpful Thug Beginner Any% percent tutorial, creating tool-assisted speedruns for Thug 2 Classic, Thug 2 Easy All Goals, and Thug 1 Sick Any% percent not once, but twice, writing up routes for new players, and running our community Tony Hawk speedrunning Twitter, Packle is an important member of our community, highly skilled player and serious competitor. He truly cares about his scene, the games, and the people involved with both, and for that I give you all the respect in the world. Thank you for all you've given to everyone, and thank you all for watching.